This video is about Axiom Process and some of the mobile acquisition options available to you. So once you've entered in case details, you'll be presented with this screen where you can select your evidence source. We have computer, mobile, and cloud. For our purposes, we're going to select mobile. And there you are brought to a screen that gives you the option of Android, iOS, Windows Phone, Kindle Fire, and media device. One of the more common operating systems we see out there is Android operating system. So we're going to select Android for our demonstration. And we want to acquire the evidence. Now, I have an Android device connected to my computer right now, and I've enabled ADB access. So I'm able to do a quick image of uh, the device in this state. So if I select the ADB unlocked, I can see that my device that I have is connected. It doesn't have privileged access, so I'm only going to be able to get a quick image, but I'm still going to get an image nonetheless. If your device is locked, we do have some advanced options right here in the advanced lock bypass selection. So if you select that, you can see we have LG Electronics, where we have a LG bypass that was recently implemented into Axiom. So if you have an LG device that's locked, you might be able to use this method. We also have some Samsung options where we can load a recovery image. What this option is, is you will load a recovery image to the recovery partition of that device and be able to access the user data and image a full physical image of that device. Now there are a lot of uh, prerequisites for this, so I would caution you and it, and ensure that you know what you're doing, but we do have that option here. You can select one of the Axiom uh, recovery images, or you can actually bring your own in if you found if you find a recovery image online. And those are a few options that you might have not known about with mobile acquisition in Axiom process.